we are excited to showcase some of the new features being released in Qubit 5.1 and includes the addition of a few features that will be familiar to our offsider and global customers. Qubit's new gross floor area functionality allows you to easily see the cost for your job broken up by your own custom defined areas. The gross floor area can be set by typing in values for one or more areas, dragging and dropping shapes directly from the viewport over the GFA value in the status bar, or any combination of the two. Qubit's GFA functionality not only allows you to see the cost per area at a trade level, but you can drill down to any heading level to validate your costs and verify you have produced the best estimate. Price your estimate by entering in cost per area rates for headings that don't already contain costing data. Qubit 5.1 displays the job percentage that a trade represents directly in the estimate sheet, rather than forcing you to go to a report. This value is automatically updated as changes are made across the job. If you have incomplete items inside a trade, the percentage value will be orange. This shows that you have incomplete items inside that trade, allowing at a glance to see where more work needs to be done. Available in Qubit Pro, the rel column allows you to quickly return multiple calculations to a single estimate item. Get supplemental information returned from as many or as few of the rows as you need. In Qubit 5.1, you can set relative values row by row in the calc sheet or across all of your items calc sheet rows, making this the quickest and easiest rel column function we've ever released. Whether you need additional information on counts, lengths, cutting lists, areas or descriptions, Qubit has you covered. For a complete rundown on all the new features in Qubit 5.1, including the auto-updating BIM takeoff in the calculation sheet and the new and improved Excel export, please contact Buildsoft or one of our trusted resellers today.